welcome back to my channel as you guys have seen by the title of today's video. Today I am actually going to be doing a get ready with me type of video because I am actually leaving the house for a change like I can't believe I'm actually leaving the house but here we are I'm actually going out for a change and I just want to put a bit of makeup on and kind of make me feel and kind of make myself feel a bit more confident and a bit more glam because to be honest I have not had a makeup on in if God knows how many days, I actually don't know how many days I've not had makeup on for, but it's been a long time. But I have been giving my skin a little bit of a detox because, as you can tell, the spots are showing a little bit. So I'm just gonna make myself look flawless. I hopefully I will feel myself after I've slapped a bit of the good stuff on my face, you know. But I also am working with the lovely brand insert name here, Hair Extensions. So please keep on watching to see what the products are feature in this video and I do also have a discount code so please make sure to stay tuned in this video to see what I'm going to show and how much money you can save and all that good stuff because you don't want to miss that. Before we get into this video please make sure to leave a thumbs up. It would be nice to get to a like goal of how many likes should we go for? Like 15 likes I'd say. I'm going to lower my expectations down this time. Also leave a comment and subscribe and without further ado let's go on with the video. Right so first up I am actually going to be starting off with eyebrows. I am going to be answering some questions as well by the way but I'm just going to get into the makeup first so I have my beautiful makeup bag right here. Christine Dior you know I love it. Anyway so yes I actually use on my eyebrows I use the Morphe eyebrow made in Latte. Let's have a look and see what it looks like. Yeah, it's at the very end. So I, I'm i going to fill my eyebrows in because, to be honest with you all, I feel as if my eyebrows are very meh when I don't have any product on because I don't have the nicest eyebrows in the world, I'm not going to lie. Like, I wish I was the type of girl who had like the full, the lovely shaved eyebrows, but to be honest, at the moment, I do have a um, monobrow. I now have fresh looking brows. They're looking a lot darker and fuller, but you know what, it's fine. Yeah, so I'm going to move on to the eye base. I actually use the P. Louise in the shade 1, I think it is, maybe it's 0 0.5. Oh, oh yeah, 0 0.5. It is way too light for me, but you know what, it's fine. Actually, I'm going to answer a question while I do this. How are you finding being self-employed? To be honest with you all, it is really difficult. In the festive period, it was really good because everyone was wanting like, the makeup done, having treatments done. The January has hit. It has been a very, a very slow. I've a, a barely had any customers, and I am aware I have kind of started the business in the middle of like a, a pandemic as well. So that will probably be a factor into why I'm not really having as much business as I probably would if we weren't in this stupid pandemic to be honest I do think it's pretty stupid now with the Boris and all his you know the pals having a party and down the street you know I feel as if it is a bit of a pee take I mean, my new favourite eyeshadow palette I'm honestly obsessed with this it's yeah, the Poundland the rose gold palette it's so cute and the brown colour in this is another level it's another level so I'm going to use this palette it's so cute it is actually so blooming cute you know so I'm just going to powder this on my eyes also have a lovely little scrunchie on my wrist I love the scrunchies at the moment do you and Scott ever argue? of course every couple argues and we have obviously had arguments in the past if we don't argue often we probably bicker more than argue because like you know you'll just be talking about you know, what's going to happen with our future and stuff and and where we want to live because obviously you know, we live in two different parts of Cumbria and you know that kind of causes a bit of an argument you know, where I live is totally different to where he lives and like I think he gets a bit defensive about where he lives because I don't you know, really want to move to where he lives because it's like a Carlisle but a smaller spectrum of it and like yeah it's it'd just be a bit pointless the moving there I would say but obviously he thinks different but yeah like of course we argue and stuff but not like a physical fighting arguing I'm going to be using the Maybelline Lasting Drama Gel Liner because I absolutely love this there was a point in my life when I never used to use eyeliner and I don't know 
So what was wrong with me because I cannot not wear it now. Like it's so weird to say that but I've got to wear it otherwise my eyes look bare. It's the same with eyelashes as well. There was like a time when like I never used to wear eyelashes and now I cannot live without them. But yeah I'm just going to put this on the waterline. But yeah it's a pretty easy step. When that's that done so I'm just going to do it on the top. Now this eyeliner is the best I've ever used. I think it's like £10 but honestly Maybelline eyeliners and mascaras are literally the best. Like I would never not I use anything else now. I'm going to use my lash, my lash sensational. This mascara, oh, it's the best. Like, the pound of mascara probably comes after this, but this is just like another level of amazingness. It's just the best. Like, look at my lashes already. I am going to attempt to put eyelashes on. So, I've got these beautiful tight lashes. I think the tight lashes are in a different box. I need some scissors actually to cut them because. So they're actually slightly too long. Hey, hey, hey. Right, okay, so. Right, I'm putting my dressing gown on me just because I've got the new the leggings on. The red leggings. So I don't I really want to be getting anything on them. Tati lashes are my favourite eyelash brand, in case you didn't know. So Tati lashes, if you're watching this, yeah, please add me to your pre hour list. I would love that, hint, hint. Because I just love my lashes. So now time for foundation. I've got the two foundations here. But I like having a heavy coverage at this time in my life, but obviously I don't have any tan on. So this is in soft beige and it's it's going to be too dark. This is my normal shade, Born This Way Foundation in the shade Snow. So I don't think I've got anything else in here really. I've got a really old MAC foundation, which I could try, but I hate the way like it applies on the skin. I literally hate it. I don't even know what I don't even know why I got it. You know what? I, I'm just gonna go for the darker foundation for today because I just wanna like feel brown again. I know I don't have any tan on, but honestly, I really couldn't care less. I'm using the Peaches and Cream PC26 brush because it's the best. The top three makeup products you cannot live without. I've got to say, I cannot live without in my Morphe Crush lip liner wherever it may be oh my god it's just so creamy and the colour it's just insane also the NARS the Radiant Longwear Foundation it's actually so good for my oily skin it blends so well and makes your skin look so flawless and then final one is probably probably my bronzer they yeah, my Too Faced bronzer it's they've been discontinued for like a couple of years now but I got this for my 18th birthday I'm now 20 so how crazy is that like I've I've had it for two years and like it's still going but yes it's a natural lust bronzer it's the best thing ever I love the bronzer it's such like a big bronzer it just it goes on your skin really nicely it's just it blends like a dream honestly Too Faced makeup is so good now for concealer honestly concealer I love my concealers actually I haven't really used the Palmland one today you know I want to test it out again it, it, the Palmland Tide and the Chick Super size, it's like a dupe for the, the Revolution one. It's a bit of like a watery one, but it's actually really good. It's obviously not as high coverage as the Revolution one. I'm actually put the Revolution one over this because I think I've got a feeling it's going to go really weird on my eyes today. And I actually use a different product for putting under my eyes. Instead of powder, I use a bit of highlighter, but I don't I use a lot, so I lightly tap it. And instead of making it go orange under their eyes, I make it they go really light under the eyes and this highlighter by Doll Beauty like yeah you only need a little tap of product and then you're ready to go I use the bronzer I'm going to use my favourite ever brush I haven't used in ages actually the Real Techniques the brush it looks like this it's so good it's so good for angled contour it's just like a perfect angled brush I use where's my brush gone where's my baby gone it is the they're not P. Louise, the Peaches and Cream PC08 the brush and this is good for kind of adding a bit of colour on your forehead and making it all nice and smooth this is how it makes your skin flawless my old cheeky blush in the shade at number 7 this is actually from college and it's one of the best blushes I've ever used also another question is what is your most expensive purchase that you have made I'll probably have to say my laptop 
Yeah, that was like a thousand pounds, but I did kind of get it as like a birthday present. Yeah, but I think I put around like five hundred pounds towards it, or maybe six hundred pounds. I can't remember. That is definitely you know most expensive purchase today, and probably coming after that is my phone. Yeah, that I've smashed more than once. <laughs> so now I'm just gonna use the Doll Beauty highlighter. I'm gonna use the PC17 brush. A lot of my brushes are their uh, peaches and cream. You don't always need a lot of highlighter because I feel like a lot of highlighter can make your face go really weird so that's all you need. Then I'll answer another question while I'm here. How many figures are in your bank? People they love to know this but I have worked very hard. I am a very good saver. I don't have a lot of outgoings at the moment so I, yes I do have five figures. You know I get paid often from more than one source but that makes me sound like a drug dealer or something but no I'm not no like off the main jobs I've employed on YouTube I've got three incomes so you know it's it's nice to be able to earn and save you know it's a nice thing I'm just gonna use the Olivia Hale gel it's from Home Bargains 99p get your hands on it before it it comes discontinued it's the best thing ever in my lip combo everyday kind of lip combo is the Morphe lip liner in Crush and the Soap and Glory Sex and Mother Pucker in Candy Queen because oh, they are the best plumping losses ever. The description your lips a lovely kind of tingling sensation but honestly it's the best feeling ever. Right so now it's time for hair and as you can tell my hair just looks really boring but thanks to insert the name here they have kind of gifted me the two lovely pieces to show you all in this video so firstly they have actually sent me the I hope it's a pony the Maya ponytail hair extension in the shade honey and they've also popped in a little hair scrunchie if you know me I love my hair scrunchies I have one on my wrist at the moment but obviously I am going to be having this one on my wrist and I might actually put this in my hair it's like a lovely silky pink one and this ponytail is absolutely stunning I'm obsessed with ponytail hair extensions I love them so much and I actually want to kind of sell my hair a bit more differently and have it up now so I'm actually just going to use this extension the important thing is to actually brush it first but as you can tell it's very straight and in my hair is very straight so yeah what I'm gonna what I'm gonna do is actually tie my hair up first and I'm going to put it in my hair and show you all. I do have a discount code. It is all in capitals, Alice Holmes, and it will save you 15% off site-wide. Please make sure to use that code if you want to make a purchase. I also do have another item to show you, which you also need to stay tuned for because you guys are in for a treat today, honestly, trust me. Right, so I'm just going to try and clip this extension in my hair, like so. I'm flip the extra bit of hair underneath and hopefully this is going to work this time because I've already tried it and my hair is just not feeling anything today. These hair extensions are really soft and yeah, they do also come with two clips as well so I'm just going to use the clips to put in here. As you can tell yeah, the extension is lighter to yeah, the colour of my hair like yeah, the top of my head yeah, that's because yeah, my hair it's naturally lighter anyway but as you can tell here is the ponytail obviously the hair is sticking out it's just having not a good day today but as you can tell it's what the, the ponytail is like it's very long it's blonde it does feel really good quality really soft it does feel like my hair like normally anyway as if it was longer so yes thank you very much presenting it over now I'm actually going to be using their hair waver like how exciting is this it's basically it says insert the waves here on the box it's such a cool sick box so I'm going to be using the hair waver also comes with a glove I'll put the retail price on the screen but you can use my code and save a lot of money so you look how cute and pink it is and it also has their logo so now I'm actually going to be testing out the hair waver so I'm really excited so yeah I'm going to go test it out I'm really excited hair is looking more normal again I've just plugged in the hair wavers on to see how beautiful 
the, these uh, look it's like a lovely corally colour but like I say it's off on there it's all electric and it has a down button a power button and an arrow button so this is obviously American so like it it's in Fahrenheit so I'm gonna have it on 100 you know 450 and like it adds up it's so cool yeah so I'm gonna wait for this to heat up I'm obviously gonna be using the glove for safety but how cute is this pink glove like it's just so pink like you know the fact all of this like all the packaging and just you know, the scrunchie and everything is pink it is so cute so I'm literally just gonna brush in my hair and double check and then wave my hair right so I've got it on 330 like it's the number I want it on so I'm just gonna grab a bit of hair and see what this does really I'm hoping it'll be better than the Molly May one because yeah, the Molly May kind of gives you kinks and stuff and it makes your hair smell of, of burning so I'm hoping this is gonna do something to my hair anyway so we'll see, I'll lift it off oh wow this is definitely more mermaidy compared to the other one that I have and I actually really like it, like look at that can you see that little nice wave? Here is the hair, honestly, obsessed with it. You know, these hair wavers are so gentle on your hair and you know, they don't you know, make it smell of burning either compared to the other ones and I feel as if you know, the waves are nice and soft and not too kind of structured. So I highly recommend you know, this beautiful hair waver, honestly. I do prefer this over you know, the other one I normally use. I will be using this more often from now on and I can't wait to sell my hair with it again and make sure to use my discount code all in capitals alice holmes to save you guys 15 percent off but yes here is the finished kind of look hair is done the makeup is done i feel ready to go and leave the house now so if you guys have enjoyed this video please make sure to leave a thumbs up a comment down below also subscribe and make sure to shop insert the name here and get your hair extensions and hair tools right now because honestly you need them in your life but yeah i'll see you all in my next video Bye.